Hey guys, Triforce of Doom here, and welcome back to Undertale! Uh, took a bit of a break from recording this for a bit, but we're back. Last time, uh, befriended Sans, promised to go on a date with him, met his standards of making spaghetti, stuff like that, and with that, I think I'm all prepped up to continue. So with that, let's go. Uh, what, what was, oh yeah, there is no run button, never mind. So anyways, uh, thanks to be being Black Friday and me having 40 bucks left in my, uh, account, after buying some gifts for my, uh, brother, dad, and my friend James, um, and I'll be giving that, my, uh, fr friend James his gift, uh, in the week after recording this, and... Why is it all icy still? Whatever. The... And now we're in a cave with no music, okay. But yeah, considering this is definitely going up after I give it him his gift, yeah, I got my friend James uh, Omega Ruby, considering me and him are both Pokemon fans. It was going to be a their Super Mystery Dungeon, but I figured I'll get him Ruby so that when I get Alpha Sapphire, we can work together. Kind of thing. In fact, the original plan until Tax showed up was I get Alpha Sapphire at the same time as I bought Omega Ruby, and then we'd both start playing it at pretty much the same time or whatever, and. The hell? Hmm? Who are you talking about? Yeah, you know what? Might as well. Yeah, whatever. Hey, d don't tell my parents I'm here. Okay. I'm just gonna quickly. There we go. That's better framing. Yeah, I just have my webcam uh, footage in the background just so I make sure I have a good enough camera angle. This is an echo flower. It repeats the last thing it heard over and over. Hold on. Hmm. That's pretty funny. I'm gonna go figure out there's a safe point right here so I didn't have to backtrack all the way to the town last part. Didn't know that's there, though. Two jobs, huh? Hmm. Hmm. That's fair. Eh, sure. Why not? A shortcut? Alright. The shortcut, huh? Yeah. Probably doing a slightly different voice than before. Hey, everyone. Hey, Sans. Hi, Sans. Greetings, Sans. Hiya, Sansy. Sansy, huh? Hey, Sans. Weren't you just here for breakfast a few minutes ago? Nah, I haven't had breakfast in at least half an hour. You must be thinking of brunch. Here, get comfy. Whoops, watch where you sit down. Sometimes we just put whoopee cushions on the seats. Anyway, let's order. Okay. Um, I'll go with fries. Hey, that sounds pretty good. Yeah, I actually personally don't really like burgers. I just find the texture of the patties a little weird. We'll have a double order of fries. Yeah, I personally prefer hot dogs over burgers. Especially with lots of ketchup. <laughs> so what do you think of my brother? Uh, he's cool. Of course he's cool. You'd be cool too if you wore that outfit every day. He'd only take that thing off if he absolutely had to. Yeah, I could see him that's doing that. Oh well, at least he washes it. But I mean he wears it in the shower. Wow, you really only mean when he absolutely has to. It's pretty cool how that dude's head is made of fire. Here comes the grub. Want some ketchup? Sure. Bon appetit. That was terrible. Ah. Whoops. Eh, forget about it. You can have mine. I was tempted to say that in a New York accent. I was very tempted. I'm not hungry anyway. Anyway, cool or not, you have to agree Papyrus tries really hard. Yeah, he does. Like how he keeps trying to be part of the Royal Guard. One day, he went to the house of the head of the Royal Guard, and begged her to let him be in it. Of course, she shut the door on him because it was midnight. Yeah, why midnight, dude? Papyrus, not very smart of you. 
But the next day, she woke up and saw him still waiting there. Seeing his dedication, she decided to give him a warrior training. It's, uh, still a work in progress. Yeah, I noticed. <laughs> uh, so... Oh yeah, I wanted to ask you something. The hell? Have you ever heard of a talking flower? Yeah, I have. I met the dude. So you know all about it. The Echo Flower. Oh, not that. Uh, yeah, yeah. They're all over the marsh. Say something to them, and they'll repeat it over and over. What about it? Well, the pirates told me something interesting the other day. Oh, really? Sometimes, when no one else is around, a flower appears and whispers things to him. Flattery. Advice. Encouragement. Predictions. Is he talking about Flowey? Weird, huh? Someone must be using a nickel flower to play a trick on him. Keep an eye out, okay? Thanks. He must be talking about Flowey. Well, that was a long break. I can't believe I let you pull me away from work for that long. Oh, by the way, I'm flat broke. Can you foot the bill? Oh, you mother! Dean it, Sands! Well, F you too, Sands. F you too. By the way, I was going to say something, but I forgot. I have those moments. So that was a thing. What was up here again? Oh, alright, just more houses. Well, with that conversation out of the way, you have so much mail. A message you should check my mail for me! Wait, no, that's very strange. So you came back to have a date with me! You must be really serious about this. I'll have to take you someplace really special. A place I'd like to spend a lot of time. Okay, we're going pretty fast now. Papyrus? My house! Oh god! <laughs> the <laughs> yeah, again, she's still one of my favorite characters in it now, so yeah, why not? Um, what's going on in that room? Welcome to Scenic My House! Grammar? Enjoy and take your time! Aha! Interested in my food museum? You mean your fridge? Please, peruse my culinary art show. Half of the fridge is filled with containers. I am not surprised in the slightest. I really am not. An empty pack of... Let me guess, that would be Sans. Impressed? I increased the height of my sink. Why? Now I can put more bones under it. Take a look-see. What? Catch this meddling canine! Cusses! Hi, Papyrus. Er, Sans. Sans! Stop playing! Stop plaguing my life with incidental music! A dirty sock with a series of notes on it. Sans! Please pick up your sock! Okay. <laughs> Don't put it back down! Move it! Okay. You move it two inches! Move it to your room! Okay. And don't bring it back! Okay. It's still here! Didn't you just say not to bring it back to my room? Forget it! <laughs> you know what? I can see me and my brother doing something like that. I really could. Ooh! It's my favorite game show! It says stay tuned for a new program, MTT. Okay! What? It's usually better than this! This is just a bad episode. Don't judge me. You don't know how TV used to work, do you? It's a joke book. Eh, why not? Is this a joke about quantum physics? 
I'm gonna say yes. This is my brother's pet rock. He always forgets to feed it. As usual, I have to take responsibility. <laughs> That's my room! If you've finished looking around, we could go in and do whatever people do when they date. Uh, not yet. A classic image! It always reminds me of what's important in life. Hmm. The door is locked. Yeah, that's someone's room. So, yeah. Let's see what goes on in Papyrus's room. Why not? Sure. Why not? Uh. Hey! Those are all the attacks I used on you! Great memories, huh? Uh, yeah, sure. T making it where I could only jump with my he heart. Seems like it was only yesterday. That was like 20 minutes ago. Yo, know, however long ago that was part-wise. Even though it basically just happened. Yeah, it did just happen. The internet! I'm quite popular there. I'm just a dozen away from a double-digit fo- I don't think you know how numbers work. Of course, fame has a steep price. A jealous troll has besieged my online persona, always sending me bad puns and a goofy fun- I'm pretty sure that's your brother, dude. That book's one of my favorites! Advanced puzzle construction for critical minds. Oh, so basically puzzles for dummies, got it. The next book's another one. Peekaboo with fluffy bunny Okay. Zandy always gets me. Isn't that like Nito? Un Undine found it at the bay. I think it's from the human world. Now I know what you're thinking. Why would a human flag have a cool skeleton on it? Well, I have a theory. I think humans must have descended from skeletons. No, it's more like a pirate threatening thing, but eh, whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyways. Ah, yes. Action figures. A great reference for theoretical battle scenarios. How do I have so many? Well, let's just say they're from a chubby, smiling man who loves to surprise people. Yeah, that's right. Santa! That's my bed. If I ever get to the surface, I like to drive down a long highway. Wind in my hair, sun on my skin, of course, that's just a dream. So instead I cruise while I snooze. Hmm. There are no skeletons inside my closet. Except me sometimes. <laughs> I was just thinking that. Yeah, sure. Hmm. So, um, if you've seen everything, do you want to start the date? Eh, why not? Okay, they didn't start! What? Here we are, on the date! I've never actually done this before. <laughs> but don't worry, you can spell prepared without several letters for my name. Uh, eh, he's not wrong. I snagged an official dating rulebook from the library. We're ready to have a great time! Let's see... Step 1. Press the C key on your keyboard for the dating hub. Er, HUD. Wowie, I feel so informed! I think we're ready for step 2. Step 2. Ask them on a date. <clears throat> Human! I, the Great Papyrus! We're going on a date with you! Eh, yeah, sure. Really? Wowie, <laughs> that sprite is so hilarious! <laughs> I guess that means it's time for part three. Step three. Put on nice clothes to show you care. Wait a second. Wear clothing? That bandana around your head. You're wearing clothing right now! Not only that, earlier today you were also wearing clothing. No, could it be? You wanted to date me from the beginning? I'll say yes, why not? Dude. No! You planned it all! You're way better at dating than I am! No! You're dating power! What the hell? Yeah. <laughs> Don't think you've bested me yet! What the hell's going on? I, the Great Papyrus, have never been beaten at dating, and I never will! I can easily keep up with you. You see, 
I too can wear clothing. In fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular ones. Just in case somebody happens to ask me on a date. Behold! <laughs> yeah, what do you think of my secret style? Eh, it's cool. No! A genuine compliment? This is a very interesting mechanic. However, you don't truly really understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said is invalid. This date won't escalate any further unless you find my secret. But that don't happen. There's no secret to my legs. Just hard work and perseverance. Hmm. My hat? My hat? My hat! Yeah. <laughs> well then, you found my secret. I suppose I have no choice. It's a present. A present j just for you. Eh. Spaghetti! Go figure! Do you know what this is? Of course. Spaghetti! That's what you're thinking, isn't it? Right! But also, Ron. This is a. This isn't any old plain pasta! What? This is an artisan's work! Sitlin spaghetti, finely aged in an oaken cask! Then cooked by me, Master Chef Papyrus! Human, it's time to end this! There's no way this can go any further! Nom 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 nom! Ooh. Ah! What a passionate expression! You must really love my cooking! Uh, sure. And by extension, me! N yeah, yeah, let's go with that, why not? Maybe even more than I do! That expression is so goofy. Ugh! Ugh! No! I broke the rating scale. Human, it's clear now. You're madly in love with me! Uh, sure? Everything you do, everything you say, it's all been for my sake! Human, I want you to be happy, too. It's time for me to express my feelings. It's time that I told you. I, Papyrus! I... Um... Boy, is it hot in here, or is it just me? Nah. The throne starts all top up. Oh, shoot. Human, I... I'm sorry. I don't like you the way you like me. Romantically. I mean... I mean, I tried very hard to. I thought that because you flirted with me, that I was supposed to go on a date with you. Then, on the date, feelings would blossom forth. I would be able to match your passion for me. But alas, I, the, the great Papyrus, have failed. Eh. I feel just the same as before. And instead, by dating you, I have only drawn you deeper into your intense love for me. A dark prison prison of passion with no escape. How could I have done this to my dear friend? No, wait, that's run! I can't feel out anything! Human, I'll help you through these trying times. I'll keep being your cool friend and act like this all never happened. Yeah, I'd appreciate that. After all, you are very great. It would be tragic to lose your friendship. So please, don't cry because I won't kiss you. That would be really weird, actually, since you have no lips or anything. Because I don't even have... Yeah, uh, like I was saying. And hey, someday, you'll find someone as great as me. Well, no, that's not true. But I'll help you settle for a second best. <laughs> hey, there's your narcissism coming into play. <laughs> oh, and if you ever need to reach me, here's my phone number. You can call me anytime. Sweet! Platonically. <laughs> yeah, no problem. Well, gotta go! So that happened. Um, with that, uh, geez, that was a pretty long, actually. Might end the part there, I'm not sure. Hmm. Wonder when I get to Sans' boss fight, because I'm really looking forward to listening to Megalovania in the actual game. Seriously, I've heard so many remixes of that song on YouTube, it's... I, I just love that song. Yeah, I might as well quickly save. Hmm. Man, I've been playing for so long. 
yeah, I, I'm gonna end the part here, but because uh, remember, I was at like 108 minutes when I booted up the game. So yeah, this has been the Triforce of Doom. <coughs> Yay, burping. Peace out.